Okay, it's no secret that I'm a big fan of that uh, masked musical maniacal maestro that's Buckethead. And uh, as well as his playing, one of the things that's really caught my attention these last couple of years is his output. Uh, 34 albums in 2013, 60 albums in 2014, and he's at the time of recording is about to release his 50th album of 2015. So he's, at the moment he's roughly putting out an album every four days. And so speaking with some friends of mine, uh, I thought I'd see you know how possible it is to write and record um, a, you know, 30 minutes worth of music, a pike's worth of music in four days. So I'm going to essentially challenge myself to do that because I've got some time off work and try and schedule it as I think Buckethead may do. Um, one of the things I'm going to do as to um, get the ideas together is something I drew from a interview with him from 1996, which is where he said he'll watch, uh, you know, films and turn the sound down, and then he'll sit with his guitar on his lap and essentially soundtrack the film as he's watching it based on what he can see. So I'm going to do that. So uh, I've got a list of films that uh, mates have suggested. Uh, so Star Wars, Predator, Boogie Nights, Tron, uh, Deep Throat because. Booger Nights isn't sexy enough. Uh, in fact, actually. Right, okay, if we take the top six, which is Star Wars Predator, Booger Nights, Tron, Deep Throat, and The Omen. And. Alright. Uh, that's going to be Deep Throat, so that'll be interesting. Um, right, so I'm going to go and put some. I'm going to just like sit that on, go watch the film, and come back in a bit and see what ideas I can come up with. Okay, couldn't find Deep Throat. I found Debbie, uh, Debbie Does Dallas, which I'd imagine has pretty much the same kind of imagery and social commentary within it. So, let's crack on. <laughs> Change of plan, Tron, because Tron's cool. Watch the uh, film and those sound ones were weird. This is Tron's theme, sort of when he's... Uh, For the um, 
Sark's carrier, we're going to have a proper meeting. <laughs> some delay on it again to be mechanical. Hold tone scale. Oh, hang on. Um, this is kind of the uh, resolution of Yori. <laughs> resolution. <laughs> Tron's finally got us, we've got the Tron theme again. Can't remember how that went now. Sun moon sound and it's just E whole tone or whatever I'll do. That was works to lead into salt. the two as he's stalking it. It's a bit Mike Oldfield. Um. It's the Vince DiCola kind of bit. Rift, you want this? 
Celtic, that isn't it? It's actually brainer, so we can kind of go a tone there and do the kind of. Okay, um, that was good, that was interesting. Um, but I've got a bunch of riffs and, and melodies and some ideas, so I'm going to try and start putting those in order. I've got an idea of essentially what scenes. Um, I'm basing tracks on. Um, I'm going to basically do it over five tracks, some um, you know, roughly six minutes each. Um, and then, so that's it now. I've got essentially four days to get it uh, all together and get roughly 30 minutes of music together. Um, one thing I'm doing is because obviously Buckethead doesn't mix the albums himself, often he goes off to, to Brian Manti or whoever. Um, if I'm not all mixing stuff within four days, I'm going to allow myself a bit of cheat room for that. But hopefully, um, by this time, four days from now, I'm going to have a, a finished album. 